Shout Factory TV, changing the channel. Good evening. I think it would be interesting to talk about fear. I still think Psycho is the scariest movie ever made. A lot of people think I'm a monster. It's dangerous to put trust in a filmmaker like Hitchcock. Psycho wouldn't have been as effective and as brilliant if it wasn't for Anthony Perkins. Tony had, the, had a tortured quality to him as a human being. When an actor gets a role that fits that inner personality that's there and brings that out, that's unique. I mean, the story about how they didn't do that and so he was really, should have gone free? I like that. <laughs> For Psycho 2, I mean, it's got big shoes to fill. How in God's name are we going to be worthy of our predecessor here? Anthony Perkins makes us believe the guy who viciously murdered two people in that first movie is safe. Then we can come into his house and nothing will happen to us. Right? Very intense. I remember sitting in the room with him and everybody had left the room and he just sort of stared and, got, and locked eyes with me for a long period I thought. <laughs> He stands there and he's got the shovel and she's just, can you take a little sip and wham! Even in movies that pride themselves on being so depraved and so out there, you don't hit an old lady with a shovel. He was evil. There is no God! He put me in an ice chest with real ice. Closes the lid. That's why I look blue and dead. I'm sure he must have thought, you know, oh, this is my legacy, this weird, psychotic, evil person that I played. He was incredibly smart. I always say so smart. He was scary, but scary in a very good way. But I think he came to terms with that to see that that, too, was a vehicle. But you'd still tell on Mother, and no one must know about her or what she's done! She raised Norman very awkwardly, and you're casting a woman who has to only be 40-ish or so, yet the voice we've always associated with her is an old crone's voice. I was in the makeup chair, and Anthony walked in, and he sat next to me, all intense the way he was, and he said, so what are you going to do with her? And I said, I'm going to make her nuts. I was kind of excited about having an opportunity to play Norman Bates because it's such an iconic character. It seemed like a lot of fun. 